Is it time to buy or sell Nikola stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Nikola. Our initial report was published on our website on Thursday, September 14, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since August 9, 2023, our system has ranked Nikola as a sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 2.21. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock experienced a loss of minus 40.72%. This translates to an average loss of minus 1.57% per day since it was listed as sell candidate. The stock lies in the lower of a very wide and falling trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good buying opportunity. If the lower trend floor at 86 cents is broken, it will firstly indicate a stronger fall rate. The current three-month trend suggests a potential minus 8.75% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 31.40% and 157.82%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 43% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 100% and 54.73%. This translates to a price range of $0 to $1.78 after a year. Our latest daily update for Nikola includes the headline, Volatile Ride for Nikola Stock Price on Thursday Moving Between $0.86 cents and $1.19. The Nikola stock price gained 32.24% on the last trading day, Thursday, September 14, 2023, rising from $0.87 cents to $1.15. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 39.18% from a day low at $0.86 cents to a day high of $1.19. The price has fallen in 6 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 9.45% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day along with the price which is a positive technical sign, and, in total, 161 million more shares were traded than the day before. In total, 229 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $263.28 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $5.45, and the lowest price was $0.521. Currently, the price is 78.9%, or $4.30, below the 52-week high, and 98.78%, or $92.84, below the all-time high on June 9, 2020, when the price reached $93.99. Analyst Ratings On Wednesday, September 14, 2022, it was reported that B. Riley gave NKLA a by grade with a initialize action. On Wednesday, September 14, 2022, it was reported that RBC Capital gave NKLA a outperform grade with a initialize action. On Wednesday, September 14, 2022, it was reported that Cowan and Company gave NKLA a overweight grade with a initialize action. On Wednesday, September 14, 2022, it was reported that Raymond James gave NKLA a strong buy grade with a initialize action. On Wednesday, September 14, 2022, it was reported that Loop Capital Markets gave NKLA a buy grade with a initialize action. Analysts have given Nikola stock a general neutral rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock and sell rating. The following signals have been identified for Nikola. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Wednesday, September 13, 2023, and so far it has risen 32.24%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, 
There is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Volume is rising along with the price. This is considered to be a good technical signal. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Nikola stock holds a buy signal from the short-term moving average. At the same time, however, the long-term average holds a general sell signal. Since the long-term average is above the short-term average there is a general sell signal in the stock giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the long-term moving average at $1.71. On a fall, the stock will find some support from the short-term average at $0.98. Cents. A breakup through the long-term average will give another buy signal, while a fall below the short-term average will add another sell signal and strengthen the general signal. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, by signal 2 days ago. Bollinger, by signal 141 days ago. Short-term moving average, by signal 2 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal 27 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 23 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 28 days ago. The long-term moving average, sell signal 17 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 3 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Nikola On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at 91 cents and 91 cents. There is a natural risk involved when a stock is testing a support level, since if this is broken, the stock then may fall to the next support level. In this case, Nikola finds support just below today's level at 91 cents. If this is broken, then the next support from accumulated volume will be at 91 cents and 88 cents. This stock may move very much during the day, volatility, and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.335 between high and low, or 39.18%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 17.56%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Nikola, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per-share earnings. A negative P-E ratio means the company has negative earnings or is losing money. Even established companies experience down periods, often due to factors beyond their control. However, consistently negative P-E ratios may signal insufficient profit and possible bankruptcy risks. In other news, the next earnings report for Q3 2023 is expected on NOV01, 2023. Analysts' consensus estimates are at dash $0.150. Keep an eye on these numbers, as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Nikola. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Nikola is at $1.19. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Nikola encounters its first support level at $0.91. Cents. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Nikola from multiple analyst sources is neutral. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On September 6, 2023, past Eric Anastasia conducted an insider sell of 6,709 shares of common stock. On August 29, 2023, Vesco John C. conducted an insider buy of zero shares of. On August 10, 2023, Mendez Carey conducted an insider sell of 3,717 shares of common stock. On August 10, 2023, Pike Joseph R. conducted an insider sell of 80,937 shares of common stock. On August 10, 2023, 
Worth and Britain M conducted an insider sell of 121,404 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of minus 26.028. Overall, insiders purchased 2,447,081 shares and sold 4,810,497 shares in the last 100 trades. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and no stop loss has been set. Is Nikola stock a good buy? Nikola holds several negative signals and we believe that it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this stock. We have upgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a strong sell to a sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Friday, September 15th, we expect Nikola to open down dash dollar 0.0850 and start trading at $1.07. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.